Welcome back once again here with Dustin and Stephanie at a very top secret location of this speakeasy. Somewhere inside the Heavenly Village, you guys need to find this spot. Definitely one of the fancier, more swanky places I've been in in Tahoe in general. Yeah. Tell the viewers uh, where, what we're doing here. Yeah, so uh, we're we're offering something that's different than than the normal. Um, it's a uh, it's we're inside the community speakeasy, um, and we're offering uh, craft cocktails for you know everybody out there. It's a little bit different of a thing. We're we're trying to do dress code and forced, uh, have a little bit of fun with it when you do come out. Um, you know, it's we, we open at five and uh, go till for sure midnight. Mm -hmm. um, hopefully two o'clock as if we stay open, uh, depending on business. But uh, it's something new. We're having fun with it, and yeah. uh, it's a good time. I've seen the the photos online of you guys testing cocktails because this is just recently opened. Yeah. I mean, it's very new. Uh, and so you mentioned the dress code though. Would this would this fly? Am yes. I am I in, or you need a blazer? No, absolutely. Okay. It's, it's nothing any, anything crazy. Uh, we're just trying to enforce uh, no, no okay. sweatpants, you yeah. know, no flip flops, that kind of thing, flat bill hats, that yeah. simple stuff. Um, like yeah. You know, through, set a standard. Exactly, right, just yeah. to have fun with it. You know, if you're going to come have a, mm -hmm. a little more of a expensive cocktail, then to, to have fun with it, enjoy yeah. it, and uh, have a good time with it. So, so you, I mean, you've had you're looking to have community events here. It's the community speakeasy, hosting events, doing live music, all that. Talk about the the other things that are going on rather than just cocktails. Here. Yeah. Yeah, we have um, we had an event recently. It was a masquerade party, and so people came in. Everybody was wearing masks, and a lot of people participated. It was fun to try to be someone else at a different time and yeah. act a little different than normal and drink fancy cocktails and be fancy. And so you're going to be showing some old school movies here, doing live music, all yeah. that. Yeah. Black yeah. and white movies until we get to um, our musicians on stage. You'll be watching yeah. black and white old movies, old baseball games, and things like that. It's a good time to pretend you're in a different time. It's, it's definitely got that. Roaring Twenties, Steve? Yeah. How do you yes. guys classify it? Absolutely, yeah. yeah. The Prohibition era type yep. of thing, but, uh, you know, kind of having that secretive part of it and also, you know, kind of having it to where it's available for everyone else right. to, to come out and enjoy, so. Talk about some of the cocktails that you guys have been trying out lately. What are some of your favorites? Oh, man. The uh, Blackberry Smash is uh, yeah. by far, like, one okay. of the best ones. It's a good Describe one. it a little bit for me. Ah, uh, delicious. Uh, I mean, it's rum-based. It's all rum-based. Yeah, a lot of them are rum-based. Um, the Blackberry Sage Smash has a fresh blackberry on top. It's a pink drink. <laughs> You're loving it. Talk about this one. We pulled down off the bar right here. This rum, super old and very, very particular. This is a 30-year aged rum. Wow. It's from Cuba. And, um, yeah, it's we pride ourselves on our rarities that we have up here on the wall. And it's... It's delicious. We make the barrel aged cocktails and just yeah. things you can't find everywhere. Loving yeah. what they're doing here at the Community Speakeasy somewhere inside the Heavenly Village. Thanks, Dustin and Stephanie. Back to you in the studio.